this thing rolling is it yeah we're lit we're lit grand so how we all getting on any of my diehard fans know out there how we start our mornings with a nice spinach and peanut butter smoothie doesn't look pretty but that means it's gonna taste all the better um where are we where are we now um oh tours day today great we're gonna go do some training later on bit of kickboxing legs are in patterns from uh from the other day they weren't as bad yesterday i must have second day soon from the insides and my legs are killing me but like i said we're gonna be the world's greatest kickboxer so i wouldn't let that step us down too much um anything else off the top of my mind there that i can think of uh weather shit really bad again today shit weather nothing new there and um I'll see if I can get anything good for you today, any good content. I'm only awake, it's about half nine in the morning, so it's still early. I'm gonna have a shower, set me bearings, and I guess I'll be back to you cats later. I'll see you soon. As you can see, we're down by the majestic waterfall. Some have said it's like the French Riviera of West Halle. Uh, not me, but some people do. Uh, very nice, very beautiful morning. I think the rain's gonna come, so I'm not gonna stick around for too long. Just back home there from all my uh, gallivanting around I was at earlier. Nice and hungry now, so I'm cooking up a nice little storm in the kitchen. Bit of lunch, bit of chicken and rice. Served me well. It's about about one bells, one in the day. 1,300 hours for you army folk out there. So, uh, yeah, I'll show you, show you what I have whipped up now in a minute. We got our nice chicken fillets. Full yellow pepper, load of peel of rice. Here's an apple for after. Dissected up quite poorly by yours truly. Have a, we even have a pint of water today, stroked out of a pub from many moons ago. Bit of ice in there. And I even lit the candle. Very romantic. So I'm gonna tuck into this. And uh, that's lunch smashed out of it then. Get up them steps, you little ratchet. So that was lunch, buried out of it. Have to say that was absolutely delicious. Cooked to perfection by yours truly. Moi. Uh, now, what else is there on the agenda? Uh, yeah, kickboxing later. My legs, I swear to God, they're still in bits. I'm not red zone class. I know I keep saying it, but it's from, uh, I don't know if any of you don't know what that is. It's like a, what is it, cycle, row, ski kind of thing with then in between that doing kettlebells and dumbbells and planks and car walk and all it's intense great though but my legs are still stiff but i don't really mind too much uh we'll work that off later uh a bit of stretching and whatnot so i'm going to take it easy for the time being now and uh chill out put my feet up it's been a hard day so far i might even have a nap what time is it it's in and around two o'clock after two i think it's in and around nap time so I might catch a few Z's and I'll be back to you guys soon. Wizard out. So here's something I got the other day actually off a very good friend of mine. I believe it to be Red Bull. Uh, don't know what country it's from. I'm going to say Indonesia or Thailand or something like that. But uh, it's not like normal Red Bull. It's like a thick syrupy kind of Red Bull. And the bang off it so it's it's the equivalent of drinking a gram of cocaine uh and it it doesn't fuck about like it's only on a 150 ml bottle and i could i basically i could i could see fucking uh sounds and hear colors i was absolutely whomped but uh it was good but like i don't know what the fuck is in it Um, could be cocaine in a for all i know but it's really, really mad stuff, and I just wanted to know if anyone else knew exactly what it was. But, uh, yeah, it had me flying. I probably don't recommend it, but I'm doing this shit so you don't have to. 
this is just a quick glimpse into showing you how the wizard lives i've got my pelly at the end there on top of what used to be uh, a set of drawers but i didn't like it anymore so i turned it into a ghetto tv stand same way um that thing over there in the corner that uh used to also be the drawers out of that so i turned that into a ghetto uh ghetto stand now i've got a little mural um place in the corner for people and um a little little buddhas and some candles got my bookshelf there my bob marley poster and then i've got my bed and my dream catcher and my stairs go down there and then i swing around this way and i've got my ghetto stand that's a box with the top of a drawer that holds a few other things and then i've got my little fridge uh, and a cup and my fan and at the minute my fridge is absolutely empty so i'm gonna have to fix that and that's my window that sits above my bed so it's quite simple easy living easy living but this is where I do my rest and downstairs where you usually see me shooting videos. That's uh, my studio. So this is how we do it. It's pretty, pretty laid back, pretty, pretty flaked. I hope you all uh, liked this version of RT's uh, gaffs. It's the Irish version of MTV Cribs. Lovely. So as you can see, it's about six bells in the day now. Uh, I got on training shortly. Um, so I just have myself an apple, some nuts and some water. I'm not going to eat too heavy. Uh, I'll leave that till after. I'm probably going to have a spinach omelette maybe. Um, we'll see how we get on. But yeah, just some pre-training food. Can you go wrong? Just waiting to go training now. Pumped. Can't wait. Looking forward to doing some good work tonight. Tired. Not going to lie, I'm tired. And I've had to watch some, uh, some motivational hip-hop workout style videos to get the mind to get the mind in the right zone that's kind of what i generally do um and yeah I'm, I'm i'm definitely looking forward to it and as well we're training in a different venue tonight usually i'm training in tala with uh tma and uh, tonight we're actually training out in rat out with tma and um, sometimes it's just nice to mix it up go to a different venue and um, so yeah there's another one as well in blessington so there's just a few different uh, venues you can bounce between just to good for the mind to see different things as well sometimes change it up uh hopefully i'll get some nice footage on the way down and uh yeah i'll i'll see you guys soon oh god heavy session heavy session but the wizard prevailed i'll chat to you guys in a bit oh look at this little Betsy we have here Look at that Bit of goodness there after training Keep me well, keep me well it will That was a, that was a heavy night I'm not going to lie to you guys That was a, a heavy night uh, Pushed through it out, prevailed I'm after having a shower And eating an omelette I even went on a little stroll around the estate I did Uh Loosen up my legs, you know, I don't want, don't want these money makers cramping up on me tomorrow. So, um, tomorrow's a rest day. Love it. No real plans tomorrow. Uh, what day is it? Friday tomorrow. No real plans. So, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to call it a night here because uh, I'm pretty tired. And um, the lighting is really bad. So... <laughs> I don't really like recording when the lighting's really shit. But then again, it's the grimy shit. So maybe, maybe, maybe I do like recording it this way. Let the fans decide and anyway. But uh, I think that's me lit for the night. I'm fucking lit anyway. So, uh, well, I'll speak to you in the morning. God bless and uh, sweet dreams. Whoa. It's only, uh, I'm only awake, it's about 8am. Uh, holy shit, I'm still whomped. But uh, I'm going to go get some content today and make some videos for the weekend. So, uh, hope you're all doing good. Have a blessed Friday and uh, enjoy your weekend. Wizard out.